Yo, it's Duff for the Cloud Chaser TV, man. We back up in this thing again, you dig? Hey, man, this shit crazy, gang. I hit this dude, AK-47. He on his live, running his mouth again. Acting like he like that. Bring your bitch ass over here. Why you keep playing that motherfucker? Yeah, I made the video so... Today on live, I seen some shit that I thought he would never admit. You feel me? I thought he would never admit this shit. This is me, right? To all YouTubers... We gon' play some police shit on here, bro. We gon' play some police shit on here. It's a part of the job, bro. For homicide detectives, their chance of solving a murder is cut in half if they don't get a lead within the first 48 hours. So I'm striking that nigga channel. I'm striking that video. That sounds like defamation lie. I'm, I'm screen recording it. I'm screenshotting it, man. I'm getting them out of here. My mom always told me, be careful who you tell information to. When it come down to this dude, AK-47, he the one went on his live two days. You hear me? Not no two months. He capping. It was two days later. Whether somebody hit him in his inbox or he heard it on a song that Von be like, yo, Moo-Wop in the cut or whatever. It's Moo-Wop. He my witness. That's his business. I don't know what made that man Want to go on his fucking channel to blow his channel up and say the shit that he wanted to say? FBG Duck was set up by the bitch. It was two people with Duck, not one. FBG Duck had the gun. The dude that was with the girl that was with him is her brother. He is Muwap's cousin. The brother, which is the dude laying on the ground with FBG Duck, set Duck the fuck up. FBG Duck. Once he move whopping them niggas in the car, he turned to the nigga, man. The same nigga and see that nigga reach for his gun. They shot Duck. Y'all niggas not close to this shit. As he shot the nigga, he was getting shot. The gun failed. Yes, it jammed, but it fell out his hand. It flew. Like once he got shot, he, it happened like that. Be how the fuck you know this? How you, I'm saying, how, like, the, talk to me, bro. You the police? Is you the LBI? CIA? What's your Because every camera showed the inside of a store. No camera actually showed the outside shooting. How do I know this? I ain't gonna tell y'all how I know this. He said Moo-Wop did. You feel me? I'm like, yo, who is dude? Queen. Okay. Yeah, he got more subscribers than me. I know why. Because he was pointing fingers in the Young Dolph case. Y'all forgot that? See, I ain't cover that. Once y'all start pointing fingers, I'm like, no, sir, I'm not in tune with that. I'm not finna get down like that, gang. I ain't rocking like that. Not at all. That ain't the type of content I'm into. We wouldn't be successful if we didn't. Academics done did it. No jumper done did it. I'm talking about all these Vlad them that are fed. If you want to be a successful YouTuber, you're going to have to. Because if that's what I got to do to get there, I don't want it. You hear me? Straight like that. Whole time, though. This blogger, two days after the killing of FBG Duck and King AK-47, was on his fucking channel saying that Moo-Wop did. He is Moo-Wop's cousin, FBG Duck. Once he Moo-Wop and them niggas. He said it, not me. I would have never said nothing like, of course he deleted that video. He talking about he could play the video. Yeah, somebody sent me a clip of it. Somebody he could play the video. Nigga, I could play the video myself. Well, play it. Play the video in its entirety because it ain't on your channel no more. I know why. Because once I put up that video, like, you right. I put up that video a year ago. See, his newfound subscribers, they don't know that this video been up. Man. They don't know that he was the first one to do it. He talking about Trenches News, my boy. Trenches News, nigga. Uh, that shit hurt, hurt my heart. I fucked with the nigga. Hold on, family. You on live with Trenches News. You feel me? You on live with Trenches News. I can't join no AK live. He got me blocked, gang. He blocked me a long, like a year ago. When I when I went last time I went on his channel, they blocked me. Come on, gang. Yeah. He said you have no block. Man, tell that nigga to come on the fake page then, nigga. Y'all remember I was up there. Like he said, missing tooth and all. I was up there, gang. When nigga like, yeah, show your face and all this goofy ass shit. Nigga missing tooth and all. What's happening? What's to you, cool? What the fuck is going on? Who is you? What's to you? We was on that. You feel me? But the thing is, it's like AK-47. He's the rat lover and he's the fucking ratter. You feel me? Bro, you don't got to be on no paperwork to be a fucking rat. Corroborator number one. We got corroborator number two. We got some nigga from O Block and another motherfucker. I ain't none of them. If you know like I know, bro. Because what I'm saying is a fact. He really did say that shit two days after he created his channel. Moo-Wop did. You feel me? Facts. This the type of shit I'm talking about. He is Moo-Wop's cousin. 
The brother, which is the dude laying on the ground with FBG Duck, set Duck the fuck up. FBG Duck, once he move whopping them niggas, be how the fuck you know this? When it came down to him saying that he not from Cleago, Chicago, and he from Chicago, and he was in Chicago. When the fuck was he in Chicago? He said he was in Chicago as a youth. What high school did he go to? What grammar school did he go to? You feel me? Because I went to Coles. I went to Kenwood. You feel me? Right down the street from Half Park. Yeah, your famous rappers, they went to the school down the street from me. You know what I'm saying? My high school. Let's go. Shout out boxing.com, man. Real talk. Yeah, it's like, it's wild to me that buddy you think that's even cool, bro. And then he talking about, this man even say on his video that why would he talk about people from Cleveland? He from Cleveland. Why the f would I blog on Cleveland, bro? That's why I don't blog on where I'm from. Y'all want to know why I don't blog on where I'm from? Fine. It's multiple factors on why I don't blog where I'm from. One, because I live where I'm from. Because I'm not a dumbass. I don't live in Chicago. I don't even go to the rap no more. Because it's race no point. I don't kick with niggas. I don't do none of that. It's where I live. Why make where you live hot? That's called being smart, not dumb. It ain't called scary. It's called being smart. Why would I get on here and tell shit that I've seen or did myself? Why? Why? So the police can knock at my door? Me saying some Chicago shit, I would rather get paid to be in these niggas' business than to get paid to be in my own. Hey, K don't never talk about where he's from. You got damn right. You got damn right. I'm not retarded. I'm very smart. Why the f would I blow on Cleveland, bro? He said, I'm going to make money off these Chicago niggas, but y'all choose to deride niggas like him. Chicago, y'all got us fucked up, gang. I know Chicago ain't doing it. It got to be this out-of-town motherfuckers doing this. You hear me? Because this don't even make no sense. He literally said that. I'd rather make money off Chicago niggas and basically snitch on them. It don't matter to him as long as he making money. He feel protected where he from because he ain't talking about the niggas where he from. But that's what y'all be on, though. Y'all be letting shit like that ride. Y'all gotta be from out of town. Because anybody say that about your city, you gonna feel some type of way that, oh, you ain't gonna talk about your own city, but you gonna talk about mine so you can make money. And they don't come see you about the shit you seen. Make that make sense, gang. But that's the type of shit y'all be on. That's the type of shit y'all be on. You feel me? He said, he even admitted that he said. Yeah, I made the video, so. He said, yeah, I got the video. Tell him to play the whole video. I could play the video myself. Why he took that video down off his page, gang? You feel me? Why that video gone? But that's AK, though. That's y'all man. It's blogging. Other YouTubers do it. I don't do it. To all YouTubers. We gon' play some police shit on here, bro. We gon' play some police shit on here. It's a part of the job, bro. I got 1,500 videos, ain't not one video of me pointing out a nigga, man. Somebody, he did that shit. If anything, I'ma tell you this. I'ma tell you how it go in this, this system. Especially when it come to these black men. It might be a situation where they seeing that person is guilty and they ain't even did the shit. So you let people go through they do justice at least. Wait till the trial is done. Wait till the, the evidence come out. Wait till all these things happen. But you know why these boys know these folks is guilty? Because they with them. They with the prosecutors, the DAs. They with them. We trying to really help. Buddy say he don't talk about Cleveland because he from Cleveland. Make that make sense, man. He don't talk about Cleveland because he from Cleveland. But that's the shit that y'all under and y'all be behind. You feel me? That shit's sick. You feel me? That's the point that I be trying to make. I tell y'all facts. I give y'all good information when it come to this shit. These motherfuckers cap it to you, gang. They telling you a 100K track is the police. That's what they telling you. A 100K track definitely suspicious. I still can't believe that ain't the officer for his swap. It's crazy to me, though. I know this ain't the city, though. I know this ain't Chicago, bro. This some out-of-town-ass people that's just going with clout. They don't even understand it. You feel me? How you on one side when his body's dropping on both sides? Everybody got a mama. You ain't know that? I know some of y'all slow, right? I hope not. At least the people that's watching me, that's listening to me right now. I hope y'all ain't slow. You feel me? Get the likes up, man. I hope the people in here ain't slow. When people talking about doing shit for one side and doing stuff for other sides, and, you know what I'm saying, vice versa. Y'all know what's going on, man. Street business. There's no reason why bloggers should be in this unless they under investigation and they working for them folks. You feel me? That's the type of shit that be happening. How do I know this? I ain't gonna tell you how I know this. I, how you, I'm saying, how, like, talk to me, bro. You the police? 
Is you the LBI? Ben told y'all. Y'all go check the lives. I said that these bloggers gotta be working, bro. I'm from the city. I'm from over east. Bro, they gotta be working. Now that shit hurt, hurt my heart about Trenches News, nigga. I fucked with the nigga. Corroborator number one. We got corroborator number two. We got some nigga from O Block. I ain't none of them. None of them. That being said, I know how they giving it up. People would just ain't randomly talking about any and everything just to get their story heard. Them the people you got to watch out for, man. I know everybody be in tune. They want to hear all these stories. Man, it's enough when it come to different cases and, and, and rappers getting hit up. It's enough for y'all to research that. All these y'all falling in love with these goofies. These niggas online give y'all all this BS. Then they turn around. They First, they tell you they from Cleago. That's Chicago mixed with... Cleveland, I guess. Then come, then come back and double back and say that they ain't from Chicago. You feel me? Yeah. Yeah, he said he won't talk about other cities because they might come and holler at him about talking about them other cities. You feel me? So the police can knock at my door? Me saying some Chicago shit, I would rather get paid to be in these niggas' business than to get paid to be in my own. He said they might come and holler at him. You hear me? Come on, gang. Make this shit make sense, man. This page been around spitting out facts for years. If you here, you probably been here. You feel me? I don't gotta lie on nobody. Dude said that shit, not me. Fuck. He is Muwap's cousin, FBG Duck. Once he Muwap and them niggas. Dude said that. He got to honor that. We gonna drop the other video tomorrow with uh, Lil V. He was saying he talked too much. Oh my fucking bloggers, nigga. You tripping. You speaking upon shit you don't know about. Stop doing it. You study mentioning shit. That's what I'm saying. You just blurting shit out. Saying shit. That's what he do. Run his mouth. But y'all y'all act like it's something different or something. Like, first of all, y'all shouldn't even be trying to even come at me at all. You feel me? Y'all shouldn't even be trying to come at me at all because... Buddy said that he was from Chicago. Then he turned around and said he from Cleago. Now he's saying he's from Cleveland. Now he's saying that he don't report on niggas from Cleveland because they might come see him. So he report on out of town niggas like Chicago. Why he can't make money on that? Why the fuck would I blog on Cleveland, bro? Y'all want to know why I don't blog on where I'm from? One, because I live where I'm from. I don't live in Chicago. I don't even go to the rap no more. It ain't called scary. It's called being smart. Why would I get on here and tell shit that I've seen? Me saying some Chicago shit, I would rather get paid to be in these niggas' business than to get paid to be in my own. That's what he said, gang. Yeah? Like, he said this out his own mouth. Dude, talk too much. Maybe y'all be so mesmerized with some goofy-ass shit. I have no idea. Because I, I can understand a slow nigga real fast. Especially a slow nigga drinking wine. He gonna be even slow. You hear me? But what's to y'all, though, gang? Yeah? Like, keep it a buck. What's to you? Because I don't get it. These bloggers be weird. They don't care. They all about money. That's a fact. Money and views. See, I got on this shit to keep it a buck with y'all. I've been doing this. I'm going to keep it a buck with y'all. You feel me? Yeah. Yeah. Hey, hey, Mo. I've been here a long time and still riding. Like, these folks, it's crazy. Like, I don't get it. I know it's a bunch of new people out here that subscribe to these different um bloggers and shit. And they think they know what's going on. I get it. But, man, when somebody play you 4K, 1080p. FBG Duck was set up by the bitch. It was two people with Duck, not one. He is Muwap's cousin. The brother, which is the dude laying on the ground with FBG Duck, set Duck the fuck up. FBG Duck, once he move up in them niggas. Bro, you got to understand what's going on. You got to take heed from him. Like, Trench's News, Ben said that he was cooperating number one. So why is that even a question? They been saying, oh, yeah, Trench's News, he cooperated number one. He been cooperating number one. He said it out of his own mouth two weeks ago, like 12 days ago. He said, I'm cooperating number one, but I ain't say this and that, which we found out was Cap, but he been said that that's him. So it shouldn't be no question. Dudes like AK-47, they try to utilize Trench's News as they connect to Chicago. He even said it. I was, I was reaching for him for information. Like, bro, for a vlog? Why would you be trying to get criminal investigation information to make a vlog so you can make money? Make this shit make sense, gang. To all YouTubers, we gonna play some police shit on here, bro. We gonna play some police shit on here. It's a part of the job, bro. These folks said this on a demonstration. I ain't making this shit up. Some of y'all heard it. But y'all will, it's crazy to me, like, how is people even going with this type of rhetoric, feel me? They thinking this type of shit cool. Shit ain't cool, gang. You been one of them goofies. Nigga, been one of them goofies, gang. Been on some goofy shit. Been trying to rat niggas out on Chicago just to make money because 
Niggas can't touch him because he ain't from Chicago. He don't live in Chicago. Even the nigga baby mama. You want me to get his baby mama up here? Give me 100 likes. I'll get his baby mama up here again. Fuck it. Give me 300 likes. You feel me? Share this on Facebook and Twitter. I'll get his baby mama up here, man. Real talk. Nigga talking about some. He apologized to me. And he said that he was cloud chasing me. Man, make Yeah, we had a little falling out. I apologize for talking about you. I just want to squash all the beef. That shit makes sense, man. He was cloud chasing me. This shit crazy. Man. I just get in tune. I just want to come on here and let y'all know, man. We see this goofy dude. We see this creeper. Gang. Stuff for the Cloud Chaser TV, man. We back up in this thing again. You dig?